Hello guys, so today uh, I'm going to be talking about my lighting I use for my gecko and what I'm going to be doing this winter for my gecko and some other technical electronic stuff, I guess. So, um, I'll start with the heat lamp. This is just like a, I don't know what type of bulb it is, but I do want to get a dimmer, which I hopefully will before brumation and she's on a 70 watt bulb i want to say 75 i think 70 watt but sorry but uh right there so i used to have 50 but that wasn't enough so this rock will just soak up all the heat then she can land on it at night but she hasn't anymore so, but, I mean, it's self-explain, you know what I'm trying to say, but, I mean, it's obvious, but yeah. So, there's a heat bulb I use, I don't know what type, but I do want to get a dimmer before winter, or brumation for my gecko. She's already started it, she's sensing it, it's her first year, so, yeah, hopefully she'll like it, or, I don't, I don't even know the time, but, yeah. Okay, so next, uh, I'll go on to my, this is my LED light. So right here, it's my LED light, uh, plant growth. See, it's working. But it's not very bright not right now, because winter's on its way, and it's not as bright. But I'm just testing to see how it would look like for the day. I'll change it more and more later on. This is my first year doing it, so... Yeah. But this LED light, I did get it off of Amazon. I If I find the link, I can link it in the description. It was 30 or 40 bucks, so not that bad. Uh, let me move this stuff out of the way. But, right here... There is a light. It can like darken it, make it brighter. Uh, blue. It adds blue to it or it takes it away. Uh, there is a, don't know if you can read that, but eight hour, 10 hour and 12 hour timer. So whenever you, you, I'm not gonna change it up cause I have it, but set up but uh whenever you turn this on and you pick one of the modes it'll turn off in the next 12 hours so then the M button that's modes changes it from white to blue then now it's back then press white two again that's what i have it on two times so it's not as bright but it's pretty good for the price and it's working well so, I'll link it if I find the description, or if, <laughs> find the link to it on Amazon. It might not be the exact one, but it should be pretty similar. Uh, here, here's my UVB light. Again, I'm just testing this out. I don't know how safe this is, but, um, this is a Arcadia Pro T5 Shade Dweller, 7% UVB. And I have this bag here because it's just to, because since it's winter, it's getting not as bright outside or where I'm at least. But this will just, it makes it not as bright really. It's a solution for now. Again, I'm testing all this out my first time doing it. But there's the lighting. Uh. I would recommend the Arcadia. It's pretty good. A lot of people use it. Um, let's go on to something smaller. So here is here. my temperature and humidity gauge. This is the cool side. It's about 75 Fahrenheit right now. So pretty good. 47% humidity. Humidity is most definitely lower on this side. I do need to get another one of these, but I use the same thing in my morning gecko's tank. It's 
it's turned right now. I don't know why, but yeah, it's nine bucks on Amazon for a pack of two. Maybe it's ten. But uh they're pretty they work well, they work good. Not much to say about them, but um what else? Okay, so right here Sorry Stark. I just got this for like eight bucks on Amazon. It's a USB fan, three modes, it's on one. Two, three, and I just use this for ventilation throughout the day. The only thing is, it is noisy, which y'all can hear, so you have to set it up some way special, so it's not as annoying like that. But I'll run that a couple times a day, and I have this small like, it's AC Infinity also off Amazon, is like eight bucks too, I think. But I just have that pointed at the heat mat, or basking spot, because cooling it down, becoming winter, I want to try and achieve cooler temperatures. Seems to be working, I guess. But this has a... It's on this fan right here. It's on high right now. Has medium, low, and off. I'll put it back on high, but that's that. And then, ooh, I do not remember the name of this thing. Oh, it's a IB Bot Air Comfort thing. I got it for 40 bucks on Amazon, I want to say, maybe 30. It's fairly small, like four inches tall, an inch or two wide. But this thing, it comes, it's Bluetooth, so it comes with an app too. But it just, tracks the temperature and humidity and i find it useful a lot of others do too in the reptile hobby it's not just for reptiles but i find it useful um it just senses the temperature and humidity uh not much else to say about it but Let me know down in the comments what, if there's any more questions that you guys have for me. And I'll surely make a video about them. But, that's mostly all I want to talk about today. Uh, there will be more videos coming soon. And, stay tuned. Bye.